What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Sinistrina One, and welcome back to more. That is right, more. Well, shit. <laughs> I was gonna say more Metal Gear Solid V, but it looks like we have FOBs now. So I know this is gonna be a little bit confusing to all of you, but since I've decided to put these missions in order, as opposed to the order that I play them in, uh, it's going to seem a little bit confusing. So we actually have FOBs now, so the increased total staff capacity, uh, and the number of units you can send on dispatch missions, which is always a good thing. Never, never a bad thing. So I know it's a little bit weird to kind of explain this and what's going on, so let's go to base facilities. FOB, and we're going to purchase some some stuff for them. We need a... Uh... Oh, you can choose where you want to do it. That's cool. Uh, where would I want to do it? We got the North Pacific, so that's east of the United States. That's a little west. That's east of the United States. That's, like, way west, I guess. Uh, I don't know. What do I want to do? It is there like a certain advantage for doing it in a one spot or another? Um, we're gonna do it right here, just because we want the weather to be nice. You know, it's gonna be nice, closer to the equator. It's gonna be a good property here. So I have currently ninety-five coins, and that's obviously because of playing the game and stuff so this was not things that I've spent on I don't ever plan on purchasing anything that that you would need to buy to speed things up in this game that's definitely not what I'm about so FOB construction complete all right has been completed your total staff capacity has increased allowing you to recruit more personnel materials procurement in the water surrounding for you to increase the amount of materials you receive on a regular basis you can now send more units to dispatch so that being said, you can see now that we have FOB1, which will have a command platform, R&D, and even extra stuff. Wow, man. How many... This is crazy. This is crazy. All right, but before we even get, you know, underway here, we can even do another FOB. Um, one thing that I'm, I'm completely <laughs> afraid of being someone on YouTube where hundreds of people watch you that I'm gonna get so many people trying to steal all my stuff that I'm literally gonna have nothing. So I'm trying to lean towards maybe not um, letting my FOB open for uh, you guys um, until I complete the actual main story so that I don't lose everything that I've built because I, I can just imagine how there's so many of you out there that wanna actually destroy everything that I have which I don't want everything that I've worked up to be destroyed. Now, I don't mind little things here and there, but I don't, I'm not exactly sure how it works. Or maybe we could do like a an event like on a Saturday or something where I open one of my fobs. You guys can come in and try to take something or things like that. I, I'm undecided what I want to do. There's still about 30 missions left. So because of that, we still got quite a bit of ways, of course, until the game is complete but I do want to give you guys the opportunity to you know come in and try to steal my stuff and I want to try to steal your stuff but uh, just because of the sheer number of people that watch me it's 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 a little intimidating to know that you know that everyone could just come in and take all of my stuff I don't know how the system works so that's this one thing um, what do we need we got 15,000 uh, it's only 5,000 I want to. I still want to wait for a uh, command platform because that'll give me a little bit more on everything, which I just need about four more thousand, and then I can do that. So why don't we make this video so that way it's not in outside of any order? Um, look at the security team though. Now it's um, oh we're 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 pretty good on that now. So I actually really uh, am enjoying that. So that's pretty cool. Uh, let's go ahead and get our uh, rewards, whatever we have available to us. Got a bunch of bees. Which will come in handy. Uh, let's see, next up what we're gonna do is why don't we go take a look at our FOB and just see how it looks. See if it looks any different than anything else. You know, I've, we've never really uh, been to our FOB so I, I wanna know how do I get over there. Do you have to get over there from 
What is this? So we have some new things in here. PF grade. I know it says I'm online right now. The PF thing only applies to that. Level 6. FOB Command 1 is a level 6. Vigor based security settings. Ah. Oh, that's cool. Why wouldn't you want to spend the amount of money? It's only 7,800. Oh, per one. Okay, I got it now. So now our defense level is 12. That is so cool. We don't want to be lethal because we want to be able to grab as much stuff as we can. So I think non-lethal would be better. cost the most to be close range. Alright. That's, uh, that's pretty cool. So we're kind of showing you a little bit of this here. FOB settings. What is the PF grade? The grader is here. These can be exchanged for rewards. Oh, we don't have any PF points. Alright, so I want to go and take a look at our FOB real quick. Oh, so we got FOB missions here. So let's take a look at this. Infiltrating targets of equal grade. Either it's still loading, or we just don't have anything yet. Obviously we haven't done anything, see relationships, so this whole new kind of FOB system just opened up. Okay, so these are, these are people. Pretty cool. See what? So you can support this user? Hmm, that's interesting. We're going to have to really, really figure out all of this stuff because we just opened up so much. Please select a mission. Ooh, we got some blueprints and 450,000. Wow. I don't want to lose all my people, but... Unit dispatched. Far waters exploration, common metal, plants gathering, wormwood. So now we should be able to go in here and just Unit do a lot dispatched. more. Nice. Finally, we can do a lot more. All right. So let's view our side ops here. You can see there's still a, some more side ops that we need to start doing. Unlucky dog, mine cleaning, extract materials, intel agent extraction. We need to complete more side ops to unlock more side ops. Uh, we looked at all of that. Let's go back to Mother Base real quick. I want to see if we can actually go to our FOB. And uh, maybe we can only get there through Mother Base. So. Please select a landing zone. 
doesn't say anything about FOBs right now, but we'll still go there right now and take a look at things. So I wonder when your horn starts growing more, or if it's just based off of how many people you kill or something, since I haven't killed anyone, you know. It's still the same size as it was in the beginning. I don't know how exactly how that works. Unit function edit. Alright, so let's how do we get to There's gotta be a way to get to our FOP. find out. And no, I don't think you can salute. I've tried like everybody. But I don't believe that there is a salute. Because I'm hitting Y now, which you think would be the salute button, but I don't, I don't really think there is a salute. Oh, awesome. Welcome back. Oh, I didn't do it. Morning, boss. I tried. Uh, let's see. So if we went to... Okay. Rank security, you can also guard against infiltration by the We've already done that. Protect your FOBs. We've already done this in the helicopter, but now it's giving us a tutorial on how to do it. I guess it didn't save it for some reason or another. Oh, that is why. All right. So we can go around and do that, uh, but how do we go there? Please select a landing zone. Landing zone. Roger. This is Pequot. Arriving shortly at LZ. Okay, so from what I can tell, there is no way to get to FOBs unless something happens. That you can't just look at your FOB. I mean, uh, if, you know, maybe you guys can tell me in the comments below uh, how would I get there, because right now I am unclear. Guess see what I'm talking about. Um, I think those are just vehicles. Yeah, so I don't I don't really know right now. So we'll have to figure it out a little bit later. I'm sure one day we're gonna be able to figure out how to get to our FOBs. It's just this game is so massive and just, you know, the scope of the levels and everything that we're gonna have to figure that out eventually. Clouds approaching. Alright guys, well that's just a little bit showing you a little bit about FOBs and stuff, and I we'll go into more detail a little bit later.
What's up, ladies and gents? I'm your host, Sinistrino One, and welcome back to more Metal Gear Solid V, The Phantom Pain. And, uh, oh, we yeah. got more. Choose a rival. If you succeed, if you successfully infiltrate a rival's FOB, you can abduct their security guards and steal the materials containers. All right, so it looks like this will just continue this on the other video, so I do apologize. <laughs> uh, we just keep getting more and more things. Owner, center screen. Let's check this out. Now we can actually visit. Select the drop point, study the platform security setup, and split. Very interesting. Heading to FOB. All right, higher grade versions, yes. Okay, so we're going to check this out. F fob mission infiltration, fob under center strain. So I am going to do my own infiltration in this video. So without further ado, we're going to do this at night time. Successfully sneak your way into the heart of the rival PF's FOB. You can capture staff from them. I'll be looking forward to meeting the new recruits, boss. Alright, so here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Remember, we set the security level high, everyone. so this is going to be even more challenging. This is for those pure stealth players out there that like to do everything without any help from anybody, which means no maps, no buddy help to mark targets and things like that. Obviously, we're going to have to do this on pure stealth. just the way Sinistrain likes it. Alright, we got two guards. And two guards there as well. Alright, let's get here before these guys. Alright. We much know where we're going. We're going to the top of the platform, but it's always a challenge to figure out how to get up there, even when I'm on my normal fob. Corners here, not really good. At least, all right. I think that's what makes it more challenging is the fact that you can't really look around a lot of corners here. All right. We did it. Infiltration successful. <laughs> he smiled. Big boss doesn't smile. Oh, are you gonna restart training from the beginning? Nah. Well, Sinister Train lost and Sinister Train won. <laughs> so Alright, well that's going to be it for the FOB sequences, so that was pretty cool. Hopefully you guys enjoyed. Again, of course, I will see you on the next main mission. Peace out. Bitches!